Okay, so the first thing I see when I open my Parent Square app is this. To extend and see more options, I'm going to click the three lines at the top, and then I'm going to click My Account. So the first thing I'm going to change are my notification preferences. So I'm going to click Notifications. So as you can see, I don't have custom settings set up. So in order to do so, I'm going to select Custom Settings, and then I'm going to scroll down. So by selecting custom settings, automatically everyone will be enrolled in the school alerts um, as well as district receiving alerts from the district. So I'm going to go down to email notifications. So right now it has the default email notifications for digest, which means that you'll receive um, one email of everything that has been sent to you around 6 p.m. Now, if I want to receive every email automatically as they are sent to me, I'm going to change this to instant. And then you can see the little circle that means it's automatically saving my text and message notifications are off but in this instance i want to turn them on and then i don't want them to be a digest setting because again that means everything that has been sent to me throughout the day will come to me in one um, text message around 6 p.m i want every text message that's being sent sent to me in real time so i'm going to hit instant and then it automatically saves as well now, app notifications, I'm also going to do instant, so that way, as things are being posted, I can receive the app notifications in real time. So, one thing that you can do is, if you only want to receive app notifications, you can turn off the text message notifications, as well as the email notifications, and that way, you'll only be um, notified by your app. Now, if I only want email notifications, I'll click that on. I want to keep the digest but I don't want app notifications. I'll turn that off and then everything automatically saves. So now that I'm done with that, I'm gonna hit this X, is customize my language preferences. So again, it brings me back to the home screen. I'm gonna hit the three lines at the top, gonna bring me back to account, but this time I'm gonna hit preferences. So the second option is where I change my language. You can change your language from English to Spanish, English to Russian. You can scroll down. There are a bunch of different languages to choose from. So in this case, I'm going to change my language to Spanish. And then as you can see, it automatically loads. Now, something to note is if you have a main language other than English in school tool, it will automatically pull into your parent square. So say Spanish is your native language in um, school tool. When you log into Parent Square, Parent Square, your language is going to say Spanish. But if I want to change it to English, I can just click Spanish and then change it to English and automatically it will change. So that has automatically saved so I can hit the X and now I'm done customizing my notification and language preferences.